Example 1. Using the properties of set, simplify the expressions below. Example A. Square root of 45. So this square root of 45, we can simplify into two numbers here. It is square root of 9 times square root of 5. Because 9 times 5 is 45. And because we have square root 9, simplified, it can be 3 square root 5. Let's say we have B, square root of 24. So square root of 24, we can write down into two numbers here, which is Try to simplify here, it's going to be square root of 4, square root of 6. And here we have square root of 4, the actual value of square root of 4 is 2. The last answer is 2 square root 6. C. Square root of 6. Sorry. Uh, 6 square root 7 plus 2 square root 7 since we have this square root 7 and square root 7 we can factorize the square root 7 and the coefficient will be 6 plus 2 square root 7 then simplify the answer is 8 square root 7 D again we have another one here 5 square root 3 minus square root of 27 so we can simplify the square root of 27 into the two numbers here equals to 5 square root 3 minus square root 9 square root 3 and because of we have square root 9 the answer is 3 therefore we can simplify into 5 square root 3 minus 3 square root 3 and if we have the square root 3 together here we can factorize it's going to be 5 minus 3 the big bracket here followed by square root 3 the last answer is 2 square root 3 Basic expansion for set. Let's say we have a plus square root b squared. So we can expand into two factors here. It's going to be a plus square root b, a plus square root b. So if we have a times a, it's going to be a dot a. Next one, a square root b, a square root b. Next, we have another a square root b and then square root b times square root b. To simplify, we can get the last part here equal to be a square plus b plus 2 square root a b. Example 2. Using the properties of set, expand and simplify the expressions below. Alright. Here we have uh, 2 plus square root 3 power 2 and remember we have to write down into two factors so it will be 2 plus square root 3 and again we have 2 plus square root 3 try to expand here it's going to be 2 times 2 plus 2 square root 3 and again we have 2 square root 3 plus square root 3 square root 3 so 2 times 2 is 4 
plus 2 identity plus 4 square root 3 plus square root 3 square root 3 is 3 then we try to simplify so 4 plus 3 is 7 plus 4 square root 3 next example B square root 3 minus square root 3 square so again we have the idea we return into two factor square root of 2 minus square root of 3 and again we have square root 2 minus square root of 3 then we try to expand square root of 2 square root of 2 the next plus square root of 2 minus square root of 3 minus minus square root of 6 and again negative square root 2 times square root 3 going to be negative square root 6 and then negative negative is negative square root 3 square root 3 the plus and the negative plus and then here you can simplify square root 2 square root 2 is 2 minus 2 square root 6 and then plus 3 because so we have 2 plus 3 the answer is 5 the answer is 5 minus 2 square root 6 example 3 we have uh, if we have two different factors here the basic idea remain the same is you have to try to expand here we have 2 times 2 square root 3 so we have 2 times 2 square root 3 is 2 square root 3 2 square root 3 minus 2 square root 3 square root 5 plus 2 square root 7 square root 3 minus square root 7 square root 5 then you have to check all the numbers 2 times 2 is 4 square root 3 square root 3 is 3 and then followed by next minus 2 square root 3 square root 5 is 2 square root 15 plus next we have 2 7 times 3 is square root 21 Followed by minus square root 45. And then last answer is going to be 12 minus 2 square root 15 plus 2 square root 21 minus square root of 35. 